thanks for watching. Uh, I have to go to work in like five minutes, but um, I'm so excited that I figured some things out that didn't exactly work out right. Last time I tried to use the recorder, the metronome was annoying and all that, and I didn't need the metronome. I figured out how to avoid that. And this time I actually used the audio recorder in the cross right here. And um, what's really cool is you can input the an imp sound, like either a line-in, you can't do both, or a mic. So I chose to have this mic. It has to be a dynamic mic, not a condenser mic. And this way I can um, have the RAV, or my voice, go into here and record at the same time. And then I recorded it there and played it back, and then I was able to, you know, kind of improvise even more over it using the Gouda drum. So this is the RAV and my Gouda uh, overtone mini and um, this is in like a equinox and this is in D major and the Native American flute was in F sharp minor and this is B minor and they sort of are all related uh, the B minor is a relative minor to D major and uh, there the a um, goes very well a major goes very well with F sharp minor and uh, well it's a little bit of music theory that um, you know, uh, it's not necessary to understand, it's just that it sounds good, <laughs> in my opinion. And uh, of course, knowledge is power, but when it works and you just fall into it, it's really awesome too. So, uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and I have to still name that piece. So, thank you. Oh, there's the Gouda, and there's the Rav. I don't know if you could see my baby. Mm -hmm.